Okay, in this video, I will show the demonstration on how to download precise orbits and clock products uh, of a GNSS system. So we run our GNSS survey here. We operated a Trimble GNSS receiver at this site and collected the data for a few hours and then downloaded that data from the GNSS receiver. This is the file name of uh, logged data. Uh, this file has extension .to2. TO2 is uh, the GNSS data format of a uh, Trimble receiver. And in this file name, the red ink portion is uh, a date of the day when we collected the data. So it is 2021, 04, 04 for April, and 21st uh, day of the April. So we need this date. So we noted our day when we collected the data. So go into a uh, Google, then search a GNSS calendar and utility, then you will be you will land in this page. So today is uh, 2022, 27th of November, but our date of concern is uh, uh, another one. So our date is uh, 2021. Here is the year, and it it was April and 21st. So here is the 21st of April of 2021. I'll click into this date. So here is the information. This is the normal date we are used to see. And here is the GPS week associated with this day. And it's our 2154 GPS week. And here is the GPS week number. It's our third day of our GPS week 2154. So it's a 2154 and a third day. So GPS week number is this. We are going to we are going to need this GPS week and GPS week number uh, to download the required products. After knowing the GPS week and GPS week number, again, type CDDIS in a Google. It's a data information system managed by a NASA. So you will get the CDDIS.nasa.gov. So open this uh, link in a new tab. I have already opened this in a new tab. So this is the NASA's archive of space geodesy data. And here is the geodesy and products. So uh, our concern is with GNSS. Open this in a link, open this in a new tab. So uh, here are options. We will go into a product holding and here is the precise orbits. Open this link into a new tab. I, I have already opened this in a new tab and this, this page will provide us with uh, two links. I will, uh, I will choose this first one and open this link in a new tab. Uh, while doing this, uh, I'll be asked to provide username and password for Earth Data Login. And after I provide my username, after I provide Earth data login credential, I will be, I can enter into a, a data directory page. So this is the page where the products are stored and the data directory structure arranged in a GPS week. So each uh, directory, each folder corresponds to the GPS week and so it started with gps week 649 but uh, the gps week of our concern is 2154 
So we will scroll down to 2154 GPS week. So here is a GPS week at 2154. Uh, so let's open this a link into a new tab. I have already done this and within within this directory, the directory of 2154, here are various products. Uh, products from various analysis center uh, but we are going to download a product from igs so igs product starts from igs and the gps week number the gps week number we are concerned is 2154 and 3 so here is uh, okay, here is IGS 2154 and a 3. So, we are going to download this IGS to 1543.clk. This is a precise clock, clock products with extension .clk. This is again a precise clock products, uh, but with 30 second time interval. And this IGS 21543.sp3 is a precise orbit uh, information. So we will download these three files. Okay, these three files from IGS associated with GPS week number 21543. So we'll click on this file, this file, and this file. I have already downloaded uh, these files here. So here is my downloaded products. Uh, these are compressed file. I uncompressed these files and put into my extracted folders. So here are extracted files, uh, club products, club products, and orbit informations. We can open this file in a notepad. Uh, and this is the uh, orbit informations the explanation for information within this uh, S3 uh, file will be provided in the next video. Yeah, here, is, here is the clock file and here are the informations within this file and explanation for information within, within this file will be provided in the uh, next video. So here are the precise products we we need these products when we do the gnss data processing of that site